So I want to do a quick test and, and I did this to check the battery health and very quickly see that, uh, this is a bad battery. So I'll go ahead and do the, um, out of vehicle test here on this little BM, uh, battery tester, BA 101 here out of vehicle. It's a regular lead acid battery, cold cranking amps for this one. It's 190 and I'll set that and then it'll start running the test. And then this will show me a little bit of life uh, left in the battery or not. And as you can see here, healthy is only at 8%. Uh, the um, charge is showing 57% at 12.36 volts. And the internal resistance is at 53. So you want that resistance to be less than 5. And then anywhere from 5 to 10, you know, it's, that's okay. It's not great. But 10 to 30 means you're probably going to have trouble. And this one here, upwards of 53, um, definitely is in the bad uh, hurt box. Now, if I put this on the charger right now and bring it up to charge, it'll definitely take the charge. Uh, that 57 would come right up. Uh, but the health only got to about 15. And then I just let it sit here on the bench for the last couple of days while I was waiting for the new battery to come in. And uh, you can see how it dropped. It dropped from like 86 down to 57%. And that health dropped, I think it was like at 12 or 13, uh, down to eight. Uh, and the resistance actually started to grow a little bit. It was at 47 when I first um, did the test. But at the bottom, it'll just tell you, you got to replace it. And yeah, it's an old battery. It's pretty much dead. Let's take a look at what a uh, good battery would look like after a test is run. Uh, this is a uh, known good battery. It's 730 cranking amps. Let's do the uh, same test we did before. Regular flooded. And then in this case, 730. Run that up a bit. All right, and you hit go. And this one comes in at, it's 100% uh, healthy. 96% charged, 12.63 volts. Very low internal resistance. See, it's at 3.66. Anything below five is going to be very good and rated for that 100 or 730 and shows good battery. So that gives you just some uh, readings, some understanding of that internal resistance. A uh, good way to just do a quick test on the battery, see if you've got a, um, a dead system or not. Hey, I hope that helps learn a little bit more about these uh, battery testers. Uh, this one from Ansel. Hope this information is useful to you. And as always, I hope you have a great day.